Okay, folks, so I just noticed this in a few clients. I have worked with, you know, a few hundred clients over the course of this year. But in October, November sometime, I noticed that there was an odd behavior that was happening in uh, clients that had GTM configured a specific way to capture page views and events, okay? Now, look at my screen. Look where the mouse is moving, right? We're going to the console. I have AdSwerp plugin. I highly recommend it. And so about after the one trust, one trust stuff, which is great, I get GA page view and shows object, object. Whoa, this is a problem. Page view is not being sent to Google Analytics because the UA is not passing correctly. What happened? I tried to replicate this and I got this error. So I wanted to make sure that everybody is looking for an object object situation that's happening on events or pages, mostly on the pages side. We'll have something, uh, a diagnostic of this, okay? So this is how you fix it. This is what's happening. In Google Tag Manager, what's happening is that let's go to the page view tag, right? So ignore everything else. Let's go to page view tag. So what's happening is this. The select settings variable is not set up. Enable override settings on this tag is clicked. And this GA tag is set up on the override. Ideally, this should not happen, okay? Uh, there's no point in overriding the tag uh, if you really don't need to, right? So what you do to fix this problem is go here, set up the Google Analytics setting, and ignore the override, right? Now, you may actually have to do override but don't override the tag itself because here I'm setting up some internal traffic paradigms too. So that's all right. You know, you want to set those up, but you don't want to put inherited from settings variable and put the Google analytics ID or any, you know, here I have it as a variable, but you could have it as an ID, uh, uh, you know, as actually a string. Um, so yeah. That will solve this issue. Let me show you how. I'm going to save this guy. I'm going to do preview again. Again, highly recommended to do two things. Okay, let's. Okay. Now let's go back and you will see my page view tag is back. Okay. Let me clean this out because, you know, there was a uh, object object showing before so as you can see cleaned up okay so that's what's happening anybody using gtm to fire page views just be aware that you need to make sure that your <clears throat> page view setting okay is properly set up you're not if, if you're going to override with you know custom dimensions and all that's fine but don't bleed this empty and put it here, okay? Put it here, not here. Simple stuff, all right? Thank you very much.